All right, so today I'm going to play around with um, a different anchor type. Sorry it's loud out here. Uh, we're sitting outside a restaurant. It's a uh, homecoming for my daughter and we're being chauffeurs. But, um, so back to what I was saying. So for day four, we are going to look at a different anchor type. And this one's gonna be an anchor type that is, uh, that is, a, that is uh, I guess, like a, a real world item. But I'm going to do it a little bit differently, so let's get to it. All right, so we're going to start a new project, uh, and I'm going to choose uh, this time for an anchor. I'm going to choose image. So there we go. Select image, uh, and the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to choose my image asset. You'll see it's right here on uh, the right hand side. Uh, I'm going to leave uh, that shape uh, right there as it is because the shape's not important for what I want to do for today. So I am going to choose, and this is something that's important to note. Um, if you have pictures or images or something like that, um, and you're using your iPad, you can't access your camera roll um, or your album, so you need to actually save it from there into your files area. So I'm going to select this image right here. There it is. And now I'm going to do AR mode. Okay, so you can see that the shape is still there, um, but I could just like say that the, like the picture's hanging on the wall or something like that, but I'm going to actually take my phone and I'm going to attach to my phone. So now it's following my phone wherever I move it. So think about other moving objects like, uh, I don't know, maybe something on a car or uh, something else that might be moving and it will affix itself to it. Um, so there it is. Um, that's how you can anchor an AR object to something that is actually moving using the image anchor. Okay, so that's it for today on day four. Um, and I've got some ideas brewing with all the stuff I've done so far with something that I may start trying. But there's a few other things I want to explore because um, I think I can do this a little more efficiently. So uh, especially using that little hack of using the image anchor, but actually having the image, the 2D image in the real world anchor, uh, not really static, but dynamic where I can move it around has really got my, the juices flowing in my brain. So uh, if you have an idea, uh, share it out. Please make sure you use hashtag 90 days of AR. Later.